G'day and welcome to another edition of Hef's Beer Reviews. Today I'm reviewing this beer here, Victoria Bitter Extra. Yep, the new VX that comes in this ridiculous 250ml bottle. 6% is the ABV, so we're only looking at 1.2 standard drinks. 250ml, of course, the old hand grenades, the throwdowns. You know what? I don't think I've had one of these, a throwy, in 25 years at least. Probably before I was of a legal drinking age, actually, let the truth be known. Anyway, let's crack it open. Pour out into this schooner glass. Have an aggressive pour, it's a tiny bottle. Alrighty, clear, golden, plenty of carbonation, finger of white head. Faint smell of malt and pride of ringwood hops, as you'd expect. Alright, is it going to taste any different to regular VB? Let's find out. Cheers. Okay, it's, it's still it's still a light to medium body. It's it's a, it's got a little bit more body uh, than your regular VB. Flavor wise, it's a similar flavor. The sweet malts there, the pride of ringwood hops are there. Uh, I think it's a little bit more pronounced, and I've got to say, you know, I'm not a big fan of VB. I don't drink a whole lot of macro lagers but vb if you watch my ranking australian lager series you'd know that vb was behind brush's pilsner behind carlton draft behind two is new uh ahead of melbourne i think um but yeah certainly not my beer of choice so uh this one to be honest was always going to struggle it's got a bit more flavour, I think, than VB, but it doesn't... I'm not quite getting the harshness, funnily enough, that I get in normal VB. Minimal bitterness to speak of. Um, yeah, it, it's still... There's still not a whole lot there. Um, I've got a lingering... A lingering multi taste I guess um, if you like VB you like this um, if you're expecting something you know bolder and uh, you're a fan of a strong lager or a malt liquor then you're probably going to be disappointed you're probably going to be disappointed anyway to be honest because it's only in a 250ml bottle. It's all you can buy it in, 250ml bottles. I paid $15 for a four pack, which is an absolute joke for 250ml. Um, I'd much rather pay for a six pack of full size beers, not a four pack of 250ml. Um, I can't see it lasting. I think whoever came up with the idea to release it in throwies is an absolute grade A moron. If you put it in long necks, put it in long necks, it would be absolutely walking out the door on Friday afternoons. Walking out the door. Instead, you put it in 250ml bottles. No one's going to buy it. Once the, the novelty wears off, um, it's all over Red Rover. Rating, eh. Look, all things considered, it's not terrible, but I'm never gonna bother buying it again. I'm gonna give it a two and a half out of five. It's a two, out of, two and a half out of five for Victoria Bitter Extra. All in all, uh, it's a pretty disappointing beer. It's a very disappointing packaging decision from CUB. So there you go.
Thanks for watching. Catch you next time on Hef's Beer Reviews.